what they have to do, huh? And, and uh, that 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 becomes a pattern because that's that's ingrained in us to do something, huh? To earn it, to be able to to uh, to, to to gain favor, huh? Uh, uh, human human achievement becomes the, the, the mode of operation for us, and yet it is not. An, an, not obtain salvation with human achievement because you cannot perfect it. Help us, Lord. And so you have to be able to defend. You say you're going to heaven. You're going to have to defend how is it possible? Huh? When, when it said, he that has clean hands and, and a pure heart not lifted up his soul, the bad no sworn deceitfully, he can, they did all the one that could get him up on his holy hill, and you got to ask yourself the question, can I, are they talking about me? <laughs> Help us, Jesus. Yeah. And you, you'll find we counter that. And the Bible says, all, all have sinned and then fallen short of the glory of God. And so that excludes us, right? That takes us out of the ballpark. We're all done, finished, kaput. Huh? And so, so there must be, there must, if God, if we're going to be saved, there must be something else that we didn't see. Mm -hmm. That's beyond, but beyond our, our senses. Yeah, and there's a, there's a faith thing to help us, Lord, that God had to give us to believe what he says about how to get there. Amen. And ain't what you do is what you what you believe. So, so, so Jews say you have to contend the, for the faith. You know, those other folks, they, they, they want to get you in, in the arguments and debates, and, and you, you know, they got their lives together, <laughs> you know, <laughs> And, and you, you're supposed to have the truth. Mm -hmm. huh? You're supposed to have the truth. And, and they start explaining that stuff, and you can't explain You can't explain the truth. And most of the time we can't because they don't read, we don't read the Bible. Amen. It, it don't take a rocket scientist, you know, to, to, to say what he says. Because what he says is the thing that matters. Mm -hmm. uh, he, he said, yeah, okay, the way you said it's death, I should die. But listen, he has provided a substitute. Yes. Help us, Lord. You know, we have to defend it. We have to know why we ain't going to hell. Mm -hmm. uh, you ought to be able to explain why you ain't going to hell. Hell, hell is a place for the righteous. Yes. Hell is a place for the holy. Huh? Yes. I, I, I'm sure I'm not holy <laughs> on my own. Amen. Help us, Jesus. Amen. And so, so God had to, God had to, had to rectify that dilemma. Uh, to get me to heaven. Flesh and blood cannot enter to the kingdom of hell. It is impossible. I can't bring this stuff up here, up there. And so God has to do something. Uh, because I couldn't do anything. Help us, Lord. Can he eat the opium? No, he can't change his color. No leopard change his spot. No, he's accustomed to do evil, do good. Mm -hmm. And so I have to depend on God mm -hmm. to do something for me that I could not do for myself. The, the, the problem is, is that I have a sin nature that, that, that fights against that. Mm -hmm. Help us, Jesus. So I'm the, I'm to defend my faith, I, I have to go to what God says. It says, it says what I can shed in the blood, right? Mm -hmm. That could be no remission for sin. It didn't say without working. Without sin. It didn't say keeping the Ten Commandments. It didn't say do this, do that. It said without the shedding of blood. Yeah. Help us, Lord. Yeah. Now, it can't be my blood. Uh -huh. <laughs> my, my blood got sin in it. Uh -huh. huh? And so there had to be another sacrifice huh, of this kind without sin. Help us, Jesus. Uh -huh. That God is able to take and to put that blood on me in order to save me. Amen. That makes that make sense, huh? Uh -huh. So now, so now you, you see, so when you're defending it, your faith, you got you to gotta know that for your you, you got to do it for yourself. Huh? You got to do it for yourself. You got, and that, that's what we start talking about. You know that you know that you know. Huh? And, and a lot of times, you don't have to know all of the th theological terms, but you, you ought to know this, that somebody took my place. Mm -hmm. And I took his place. Yeah. <laughs> somebody took my place, right. and I took his place. Right. What, what, what I deserve, he took it. And what he deserved, he gave it to me. Ah, right. uh, help us, Lord. And so Jews now say you ought to, you ought to be able to contend for your faith, defend your faith. Uh, 
when I start trying to explain this to people, I say, well, you know, we always start, we always start with God, right? Because God, God, God is where everything begins. Uh, so, somebody messed up with God, right? Mm -hmm. Help us, Jesus. Mm -hmm. That's the whole thing. So, somebody, somebody messed up, huh? And so we had to go. But well, we start with Him. Somebody violated Him. Well, where did it happen? At? Well, the Bible tells us. Go right back to Genesis. That was a problem we had. Huh? The first man. Yes. Yes. Help us, Lord. Because some folks don't believe in Genesis and all this stuff. But if you leave this out, you can forget about everything else. Yeah. Sin had to have an origin. Mm -hmm. Sin, if some, somebody had to be violated way back here in order for it to make its way clean through you, you know, from past to present, huh, that affect all humanity. By one man, sin came into the world. And from sin came death. Huh? Oh, help us. And all men, oh, yeah. all men die because all men sin. Amen. Oh, help us, Lord. Amen. <clears throat> so, I, I mean, I got to defend this now. Mm -hmm. I got to defend it against the Jehovah Witness, huh? Who says, who says that Jesus, who is the propitiation, the atonement, that he was just a good man, just mm -hmm. a prophet. He was a son. He was a son. Mm -hmm. and said, which says that God got a whole lot of sons. Right. Uh, I, I got to defend it against their theology. Huh? Mm -hmm. Because if he was just a son, then he couldn't die for me. That's right. Help us, Jesus. Huh? He had to be God-man. Mm -hmm. huh? Just as much God as he was man. Oh, Help okay. us, Lord. Okay. Because the, the offense was against an eternal being. Mm -hmm. An infinite being. And so, so, the, so, so the punishment and the judgment had to be inflicted on an infinite being mm -hmm. in order to compensate on a tone against this infinite being who's offended. And, and so man couldn't do it because he's finite. Mm -hmm. And so God himself had to come down and become a man. Mm -hmm. Oh, help us, yeah. Jesus, oh, help yeah. us, Lord. And, and, so, and so, listen. So the Bible presents him as such. It tells you about how he does, did God things. What God things? Well, he, you know, if the, if the elements recognize him, he's the only one that could speak to water and wind and storms. He's he the only one that even the demons recognize and say, we know who you are, the Holy One of God. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Well, help us, Jesus. Oh, yes. Yeah. Yeah. And so he did God thing. And listen, the greatest thing that he did, watch this now, the greatest thing that he did, he died, mm -hmm. but he didn't stay dead. Mm -hmm. <laughs> he didn't stay dead. His, his death was perpetuated against him because he took all, he took humanity upon himself. He died because all that sin, he died because he took our place and he was he, he, he was human and God, and so death was the place was inflicted upon him. He died. He became a little lower than an angel for the specific oh, yeah. purpose of dying. Yeah, but yeah. now listen, if, if if he was just like us and had sin, you know, the, the law of sin would have kept him in the grave. Amen. Oh, help us, mm -hmm. Jesus. But it couldn't hold him because he only died for us. Yes. Yeah. You get that get the picture? Mm -hmm. And so, and, so, and so once he died for us, that couldn't hold him. He had to get up. Let, that had no legal right to hold him mm -hmm. because he died for us. He died as a substitute. Mm -hmm. He died for us. Now, when we defend him, our faith, that, that's part of the faith, understanding yourself. Understanding you, you, can't, you can't just throw out theological terms and not understand. You got to understand and you got to pray because it takes a while for this stuff to settle in your spirit. Because remember, you got an enemy within, right. mm -hmm. which is your sin nature. Mm -hmm. Help us, Lord. It, it fights against truth. It keeps truth from selling in the in in, in your soil. You know, anything that comes as truth, it fights. It fights. Now lies, it will, it will take it hurt. Mm -hmm. Help us, Jesus. <laughs> oh, yeah. You you're more receptive to lies than anything else. And listen, when they start telling lies, your ear you. Come bugs bunny, your ears just flop up. <laughs> Help us, Lord. And you're, you're like Superman, you're able to hear the whispers. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I, I, I know they talk, you heard it. You heard it. <laughs> but truth, you gotta say, What you said, Pastor? What you said? What you said in that? Well, you gotta go over and over. And listen, that ain't strange because Jesus had to do the disciples that. 
He had to keep saying the same thing over and mm -hmm. over and over and over again. <laughs> Help us, Lord. Yeah. And so Jude, now, Jude talks about contending for the faith. So when we look at the book, it says, first, first, the very first verse, you say, Jude, a bond servant of Jesus Christ and brother of James. Mm -hmm. You notice he doesn't claim, he doesn't, he doesn't play, he doesn't say I'm the half brother of Christ, does he? Mm -hmm. Nah, he said I'm the he said the brother of James. Mm -hmm. uh, now, now none of those boys believed in Christ, talking about his family, until after the resurrection. We're not talking about Mary, but those other boys, they had a problem with him. Mm -hmm. Only after the resurrection do you find them part of the church. Mm -hmm. uh, they, 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 didn't, they, didn't, they didn't believe it. One time they told him, go show yourself up there. They, they so they could believe it. Go show you. And he wouldn't move. He waited until after they left. Then he went up to the, uh, to the, to the feast. Uh, they, they, had, they were skeptics until after he had risen from, from the dead. And now you find they have, they have positions, but now they, they are believers. And he doesn't claim, he doesn't, that nepotism thing, that I'm, I'm Jesus' brother. He said, he said I'm a bond servant. Mm -hmm. no. And he said, he picks those terms because of the opposition that had, and we're going to look at that, that has risen up in the church. He chose those terms, those terms specifically because that's part of his, part of his rebuttal against the people that are in the church that are giving them hell. Help us, Lord. Mm -hmm. This is what he said. He said, for those who are called, beloved in God the Father. Who called them? God, God the Father, Father right? Mm -hmm. Yeah, he called them, right? And kept for Jesus Christ. God the Father called. What do we call that? What do we say that is? That's the, that's the doctrine of what? When God called them. When God picked you out. It's the doctrine of election. election. Yeah, the doctrine of election. The, the Father, the Father elects. He elects in eternity. Yeah. Help us, Jesus. And the Son comes in time mm -hmm. to die for whom the Father has elected in eternity. And remember with Jesus all name, he said, all that was the Father, Father, those that you gave to me, Lord, that belong to you, all thine now are mine. Mm -hmm. See, they, so, so your salvation begins, and I told you, this book is heaven doctor, do your salvation begin where? In eternity. Mm -hmm. Who did it? God the yeah. Father. Yeah. Right? God the Father did it. Huh? He said, and kept for Jesus Christ, may mercy and peace and love be multiplied to you. Huh? Mm -hmm. uh, and this is why it says, behold, beloved, while I was making every effort to write to you about our common salvation, mm -hmm. I felt the, necessary, the necessity to write to you appealing that you contend earnestly for the faith which was once for all handed down to the saints, for certain persons have crept in unnoticed, those who were long beforehand marked out for his condemnation, ungodly person who turned the grace of our God into lasciviousness, and deny our only master and Lord Jesus Christ. They, they were on the, the, this church, and I told you, they battled for the truth from the beginning all the way to the end. This is the last book, and remember, God gonna settle this whole thing in, in Revelation. But from, from the beginning of Genesis up until this last book, the fight and the contention for truth goes on. And what happened is that within the church you had these heretics. Uh, you had the you had the the Gnostics uh, and the Libertines and and these kind of people who had made their way into the church and they came up in the church and caused a lot of hell in the church and then what was outside the church but what comes was it was in the church already that starts a whole lot of the problems and so anytime you get these two groups listen you have you have you have you have the Gnostics, remember? You have the, the Libertines. Uh, you, you probably had the, the, the Judaizers, and, and their, 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 their contention is always something other than uh, being saved by grace through faith. Help us, Lord. Mm -hmm. if, if, it ain't, if, it ain't, if it ain't being saved by grace through faith, 
If it ain't that, then, it, then the, other, the other side would be human achievement. Help us, Lord. <clears throat> if it ain't, it, I repeat, if it ain't God saving you by grace through faith, everything else is human achievement. All religions is about human achievements. Mm -hmm. You do Hindu, you do, you do Islam, you do, do, watch this, you do Catholicism, Catholicism, you do every religion. It's either you're saved by grace and faith, mm -hmm. or you got to earn it. That's human achievement. Mm -hmm. uh, you say, well, why, you put, why you put Catholicism in there, Pastor? You're crazy. Well, wait a minute. Because that's what it is. <laughs> uh, you got to earn it. You got to. You gotta, you gotta do something for the sacraments, whether it's marriage, whether the gift to the poor, whether to do this or do that. Anytime you have to do something, help us, Lord. It's human okay. achievement, huh? All religions are human achievement. Only the, only the gospel, huh, says to you, God has already done it. Mm -hmm. Help us, Lord. Everything needful to save. You God has done it through Jesus Christ. And you can't earn it, you can't work for it, and any time they attach something to it, it, it ain't the gospel. It's another gospel. Help us, Lord. And so, and so these, these Gnostics, 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 Gnostics deal with, do it, deal with, then you know the word knowledge, mm -hmm. right? Or always some little secret knowledge that they had that get you an inroad to get you to heaven. A lot of these people is infected with that kind of thing. You know, little, little, little small little religious groups, little secretive religious groups that wants control and wants to know what you're doing 24 7, what's happening in your house, and you got to report to somebody, huh? And, and they, 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 they got something special that they, that they know that nobody else knows that, that they'll, they'll tell you in order to get you to where you need to get to. It, it's Gnosticism. Help us, Lord. And they got a whole, a whole line of stuff that's, that is crazy. Uh, and if you try to work that into your brain, it, it, that you'll go crazy. Help us, Lord. Because there, there are certain things that you, you if you belong to these, this kind of thing, you have, you have to, to know in order to, to fit in and the, and the raise from where you are to where they want you to be. And, and listen, in the gospel, Paul said, listen, I don't know all this. The only thing I know about, I want to know is Christ crucified. Mm -hmm. Huh? All that mystery stuff and, and, and all that crazy stuff that, because mm -hmm. men do that because it gives them a sense of importance. Help us, Lord. If, if, if they, <coughs> and, and the, Greek, the Greeks love complicated things because it elevated them, the, big, the great anchors. The great thinkers and all this little kind of crazy stuff. And it, it, it puffs me up. Huh? And, and, and tell you all the secrets, how to stand. And stand like with your feet this way. Stand, look toward the east and look toward this way. And all that stuff that they attach to it. Help us, Lord. Yeah. That, that can't save you. That, that, that put burdens on you. Help us, Lord. And so, and so, and so, and so these, these uh, Gnostics had got into the church and have, it, it have, have taken and, and added all this old stuff into the church. And it, make, it makes things hard. You know, you won't come to church because it, take, it takes away your freedom. <laughs> if, if you got to contend with, they say to you, you got to wear black, black suits on first Sunday, you got to wear the tie, you got to do this, you got to do that. Women, you got to have your dress down low, you got to do this, you got to, and all of a sudden, all that becomes part of you being accepted by God because the church wants you accepted by them. And so they're actually the ones that, you, that sets the standards. Hey, listen, Jesus said to the Jews, Remember, and they, they tried to get him to fall in line with those crazy traditions of men. Mm -hmm. And he said, yeah, you have taken the tradition of men and made them, made, made them the, uh, the doctrine of God. Mm -hmm. God didn't tell you to do all that old crazy stuff. Mm -hmm. <laughs> he, said, he, said to the, he said to the people in front of those Sadducees, he said, listen, there's something wrong with them. Mm -hmm. huh? they, they don't have any substance. Help us, Lord. Yeah, they, they, they look like it, but they're not it. 
Huh? And, and that's what that's what that's what those kind of religions will do. It looks like it, but it ain't it. <laughs> it ain't it. I'm telling you, it ain't it. Huh? What is it is that God comes and change your heart. Yes. Oh yeah. Help us, Lord. Change yeah. your heart. Yeah. yeah. Set you apart from your sin. Mm -hmm. Set you apart under Him. And begin the process of sanctification. How huh? get getting all that stuff out of you. Help us, Lord. Mm -hmm. Transform your mind. Yeah. Help us, Lord. Yeah. That that's an it thing. But why why he, why he's doing it? He's saying to you, my beloved. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Oh, thank you, Jesus. Yeah. Ain't that something? Yeah. Yeah. Oh, yeah. yeah. He he said, my my beloved. Because listen, we're saved. Mm -hmm. And being saved, help us, Jesus. Uh, the Lord is, is working on us to make us to be what he says that we, that we are. Yeah. And, and so, so these Gnostics, they, they say the only way that you can, you can elevate this thing is that you got to have these little secret little, little things that we know that we'll, we'll tell you if you qualify. And we'll, we'll, the more we tell you, the more you're able to. It, it ain't what you know. You could know all the wisdom and all that mysteries and all that stuff and still go to hell. Oh, yeah. Help us, Lord. Yeah. Yeah. Ain't, ain't about, ain't about all the, and, uh, listen, ain't about, it, it said, let the, let the, don't let the wise man brag about what he, his wisdom, mm -hmm. or the rich man his riches, or the strong man his strength, mm -hmm. but listen, if he's going to brag, brag that he know me. Oh, yes. yeah. Yes. Help us, Lord. Yeah. Oh, yeah. So they, they could, Run their mouth and talk and all that, and sometimes you gotta let let the religionists just run their mouth and just talk and say, "Look, I know I'm saved." <laughs> mm -hmm. They 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 can get the posse together if they want to, but I know I'm saved. Mm -hmm. Help us, Jesus, mm -hmm. huh? They they can create they can create uh, badges and create uh, 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 <coughs> uh, uh, levels and so forth and so on, but I know I'm saved. And, and all that stuff they talking about, I'm not gonna let them. Corral me into that kind of a, that kind of a stuff. Mm -hmm. Help us, Lord. You be you be jumping through hoops, <laughs> and that's that's what religion make you do. Jump through hoops, mm -hmm. and they determine they determine how many hoops you got to jump through in order to get you to heaven. Mm -hmm. Oh, help us, Lord. Help us, Lord. Help us, Lord. And so he said, he said, for certain persons have crept in. Now we said we're crept. That's kind of sneaky, huh? Mm -hmm. Snakes, snakes will sneak in. People, you find snakes everywhere. Anyway, they find a snake. <laughs> uh, anyway, you find that. You, 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 you want to think about it, there's a snake. That was long. Uh, your daughter always told me, I'm looking for stuff, and they be right there. Talking about, if, 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 it was, if it was a snake in a picture, I, I said, Excuse me. I said, What the hell is a snake doing in my house? <laughs> Yeah. But they, 
they could do the song and dance routine better than Christians could do it. They didn't know how. They didn't know how to give you all the pats on the back and the accolades and all that stuff and the appearance. And, and Jesus said, man, they, but they have no fruit. Mm -hmm. huh? And that's, that's how you tell. That's how you tell if a person has been born again. Mm -hmm. There ought to be some fruit. You may, you may not have all the fruit, but all of you some. Amen. Huh? <laughs> and, the, and, the, and the first fruit that you look for is, is the fruit of what? Love. Uh, right? Because everything, everything comes from love. Love comes from love. Your peace and your joy. Love, all that comes as a, as a byproduct of love. And so you look for that. Huh? And, 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 and Jesus said it's by this. Talk about that. Nobody got love about this. Y'all men know that you're my disciple because you got love one for one for another, and so and so they they crept in and listen. They was convincing the church that they were all that. They was convincing the church that they they were all that in the bag of chips. They 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 had the church beho behooved they, that they were somebody, huh? But but something was not right, and you find it even in the book of First John, there was something that was not right with them. They, 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 they theology, the orthodoxism, and they practice were different. They were saying one thing, but they was engaged in something else. Mm -hmm. And listen, listen to the word that he used, lasciviousness. Mm -hmm. Oh, those little sly devils. Mm -hmm. Help us, Lord. <laughs> those little low-down, immoral things. Uh, they, were <laughs> they, they, were, they were saying one thing, mm -hmm. but they had something else on their mind. And he used the word lasciviousness. Mm -hmm. That's that immoral stuff. That's that sexual stuff. <coughs> and remember, they came out of they came out of that kind of environment yeah. that in their churches, sex was part of the thing that they used to rise up to their God. Yeah. How, that, that's why Torrentia had we had two thousand prostitutes mm -hmm. that, that 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 handled business in the temple. Huh? And so in the, in, the, in, the, in, the, in the world's religion, that's what part of it, because the devil wanted to destroy the temple. Yes. Help us, Lord. He wanted to destroy this temple. Huh? This, this temple is the, is the temple of the living God. Yeah. He wanted to defile it. Huh? And, so, and so sex, sex in that respect, became part of the religion. Mm -hmm. And so what, what happened in the world here, they take and bring it in, in, the, in the church. And they start convincing, convincing the church that this is part of this is part of the teaching, the doctrine, and part of what we do in the church. And you find some stuff in the church, sexual stuff in the church that they you, that they people can discover, and you might know of some stuff that uh, it turn your head upside down. Hmm. Help! And they made it part of the church. Hmm. You had churches where everybody running with everybody. Oh, Lord, listen, everybody running with everybody. Help us, Lord. Mm -hmm. And you think, well, how in the world can that be going on? Mm -hmm. It's the stuff from the top and, and work its way all the way. Oh, and, work, yeah. and everybody just got a whole whole thing going on in the church, mm -hmm. in God's place, right. and be justified. Right. Then you say, two sheets, two sheets can't dirty up each other. <laughs> Help us. <laughs> mm -hmm. Lord have mercy. And so, so this is this is the devil or the enemy way. Of destroying the validity of the church because the church is a holy place mm -hmm. because it belongs to God. Mm -hmm. uh, the emphasis is on holiness, but when it is perverted, when folks take and t turn the doctrine, twist the doctrine, and which that's what these that's what these Gnosticists were doing because they believe the theory of dualism, uh, mm -hmm. that that the, that the, that the material is evil, mm -hmm. only the spirit yeah. has value. And so in that case, that case, we, we do one of the two things with the spirit, with the flesh, we let it run, do whatever we want to do. Mm -hmm. Huh? If we want to hey, fornicate all day, look at it, it says, don't mean now let it enjoy itself, burn itself out. Or they say we can we can keep it suppressed. Mm -hmm. We don't wash it, we don't feed it, we buff it, huh? <laughs> That, that's how you got those monks, that kind of monk thing earlier mm -hmm. in Christianity. They, they separate themselves and right. punish themselves uh, mm -hmm. to suppress the flesh. Mm -hmm. Help the Lord. Help us, Lord. And when, when, listen, what the easiest thing the Bible says to do is walk in the Spirit. Mm -hmm. 
Mm -hmm. you, you ain't got to beat it up. You ain't got to you ain't all that starving me. Help us, Jesus. <laughs> <laughs> oh, no, baby. I got no sense for that. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to walk in the spirit, and I'm going to enjoy what God has given me to enjoy. Oh, yeah. Oh, help us, Lord. Uh -huh. and, and, so, and so this is part of the, the stuff that the church, and remember, they continued for the faith, and they, they, they battle for truth. And all this, is, and he said, you got to contend for it because it's always a threat to it. There's always a threat to it. Oh, somebody always want to take your freedom. Mm -hmm. Help us, Lord. Want to take your freedom. Uh, Donald, hit that air for me, please. Um, we, 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 got, we, got, we got women in here, folks, who are listening. On, on, we, we got to have the air turned on for them. Yeah, let them, they're flashing over here. Let them turn both of them on down. I got, I got, I got a mother and daughter in here, Lord. Oh, <laughs> and, and, and so, and so, and so, and so, this is this is what took was taking place in the church that Jude is is talking about, and he, he said, contend for it, fight for it, fight for it, fight for it, fight for it. Because all of us don't have all this stuff right, all of us, you know, we're still working, we're still, but the fundamentals should be, should be there. Huh? Your salvation, who Christ is, huh? where you're headed to, am I going there or not? All that's, all those are settled things, right? Mm -hmm. you, know, you know who God is, and you know there is a God. Yes. Help, help us, Lord. Oh, they, yeah. they, they, do you know that all that fool said there ain't no God, huh? And, you're, and now, now you understand your relationship to this God who made the heavens and the earth, mm -hmm. who saved you, huh? It ain't, it ain't just a God, a transcendent God way out yonder, huh? In the nebula somewhere, but it's a personal God. Mm -hmm. You belong to him and he belongs to, to you. He claims you. He claims you out of oh. out of the mess, right? That's right. He claimed Israel out of their mess, right? He delivered them, he saved them, oh. and so so he claims you out of the mess. Thank you. Mm -hmm. uh, and so and so you know, and then, then you, now you understand your relationship to Christ. You can't have a relationship to the Father without knowing the relationship to the Son. Amen. Help us, Lord. Yeah, a lot, a lot of people, that's all they say, the Father, the Father, the Father. Listen, you got to go to the Son. Yes, yes. This, this ain't a Unitarian thing. You know, the Unitarians say that, that, that Christ is both the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. He's one. Mm -hmm. But then what Jesus said, <laughs> Jesus prays to the Father. He sends the Holy Spirit. So, so the evidence is that the triune God is. We love the we love the son and we love the father yeah. because the son points to the father yeah. and the father points to the son. Yeah. <laughs> Help us, Lord. Yeah. yeah. And so we're in this we're in this relationship, in this relationship that he started. Help us, Lord. He initi he initiated this relationship. I didn't initiate it. He did. Mm -hmm. Help us, Lord. And listen, all that is about this relationship, he started it, and he that begun a good work is going to complete it. He's working on me. He's already assigned my name yes. on the last book oh, of yeah. life. Thank he already has determined my destiny. I'm going to heaven with to be where he is. Help us, Jesus. Now, now, in order for, for listen, to, 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 he saved me to do one thing, and that's to glorify him. That's all I'm trying to say. Yeah. Say. And so, so my responsibility, my love responsibility, is that I love him enough to show him everywhere I go. That's right. Display to the world what kind of God that he is. Right? Okay. So now, this is, this is, this is, this is, uh, verse 3. <clears throat> now I desire to remind you. Though you know all things, once of all, that the Lord, after saving a people out of the land of Egypt, subsequently destroyed. Now he's talking about the judgment. Five. Well, this is verse, verse 5. Mm -hmm. Yeah, verse 5. I repeat it again. He said, Now I desire to remind you, though you know all things, once for all, that the Lord, after saving people out of the land of Egypt, subsequently destroyed those who did not believe 
and angels did not keep their own domain, but abandoned their proper hoard. He has kept in eternal bonds under darkness for the judgment of the great day. Mm -hmm. It just says that the judgment of God, that God has have, have set judgment not only on, the, on folks who didn't believe, but even on the angels, and have, mm -hmm. have, have, have placed them in, in hell, or placed them in a pit until the day of judgment. Help us, Lord, because they violated, they, they, they left their domain. Uh, remember, remember going toward the, the, the destruction of the world. Watch this. You had you had the mingling. You had the mingling of of demons and women. Now, now you can't get you can't get you can't get spirit to flesh. You can't get spirit to flesh, but you can get this. You can't get men who are demonized. And going towards the last days, that way, the last days of the, on earth before God destroyed, set the flood. That's what you had. Stuff had got so bad, huh? That men had co 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 cooperated so much with demons that they become demonized, and they had babies. They had they found women and had babies, and from that came giants. Mm -hmm. Help us, Lord. Uh, I could support that. You know that, that that's that's. That, 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 that what took, and so God had to destroy, God had to destroy all of that in order to save humanity. Mm -hmm. How many did he say? Well, he saved, he saved Noah, his, his uh, what is it, two sons, mm -hmm. and their wives, and his wife. You mean Lot? I'm talking about mm -hmm. Noah. Noah. Mm -hmm. Noah. He saved Noah, didn't he? Noah preached for 120 years mm -hmm. and saved what is that, five or six people? Noah. He saved. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We'll get a lot. Yeah, you know, <laughs> that's part of the judgment. He, he, but he started with Noah first. He started with Noah first. Yeah, you remember he said he said he said Noah and Noah preached for 120 years, telling people to rain, and then while he was telling the the whole world was going downward, just it was spiraling downward immorally mm -hmm. until it was cohabitant. And listen. Right now, you got almost the same kind of thing. People are treating uh, this demonic thing just like it ain't nothing. People are Satan worshiping, right? In certain parts of the world, of the country, they're worshiping the devil. Yeah. And so, this has become a lawless land, an immoral land. They've taken, they've taken what's good and flipped it. They took what's right and flipped it, huh? And they celebrate it. They celebrate homosexuality. Mm -hmm. They got flags. They got flags all, we in the community got flags all over the place. <laughs> and, they, and, and, and the crazy people, they hang up a rainbow flag, which represents the judgment of God. Mm -hmm. this, I, this all they said, I'm not going to destroy the world with water but I'm going to burn it up. So they, they got a flag right in front of that door. God ain't got to look too far for them. <laughs> <laughs> Help us, Jesus. Amen. Help us, Lord, help us, Lord. But sin make you crazy. Mm -hmm. How, they, they take God's own word and flip it. And they say, he's a God of love. God love everybody. <laughs> but lo lo love got standards. Mm -hmm. Help us, Jesus. Oh, yeah. L love, don't be, lo 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 love begin, begin with loving God. Oh, yeah. yeah. If I love him, then I'm going I'm to I'm act. My character, everything, is going to be in accordance with my love to him. Mm -hmm. And I'm gonna, I'm gonna do what he said do. Mm -hmm. And Jesus said the same thing. Then he said, "If you love me," he said, mm -hmm. "Give me that old talk and all that old running your mouth and all that right. stuff." Right. And you know, coming. I, I, I pay my tithes and I, I wear my all, all, all the old crazy stuff. I know my prayers. The air I lay me down. I know my prayers. <laughs> <laughs> I don't hear that crazy stuff. Mm -hmm. If you love me, he says, "Keep right. my command." That, that's the telltale sign that you really, really love the Lord. Mm -hmm. That you're willing to do what he says to do in spite of. It, over, it overrides everything. My love for God has to override my love for my wife, my children, for everything. It has yeah. to override all these things. Oh, yeah. uh, to make it genuine. I can't, I, can't have, I can't have anything to take his place. Amen. Because Amen. if it takes his place, and that's a danger <coughs> If it takes his place, then it becomes it becomes an object of worship. Yes, mm -hmm. And listen, God is a jealous God. Yes, he, is. He, he, he ain't going nowhere. 
but it could sure move your idol out the way. Yeah. Ran right since you. <laughs> you skip church to what wax your call. <laughs> <laughs> You can live like hell here if you want. If you, you don't walk right, mm-hmm. 
Because the blessings flow with obedience. And you could, you could, you could, you could, you could live like hell as part of God's chastisement because you're not walking right. But God is always a God of forgiveness. Slow to anger and plenty of to mercy. God want to pick us up. God want to use us. God want to display us. Huh? Want to put us on the billboard. Look at this. Look at this. Huh? <laughs> he wants to do that. He gets his glory from that. Oh, low it down, no good, good for nothing folks like us, fit for nothing but hell. God has picked us up and turned us around and put our names in the Lamb Book of Life. All of the angels in heaven know who we are. Oh, yeah. Oh, help us, Jesus. Y'all look great at y'all. I know they know who I am. I know they know who I am. <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> Yes, indeed. Yeah, I'm the, I'm the, listen, I'm the son of the king. I'm the king's son. Oh, yeah. There would be, that would be a dereliction of, a dereliction of duty if they did not know. Mm -hmm. Help us, Lord. I'm royalty. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Help us, Lord. I'm royalty. Oh, yeah. I've been adopted into the family. Yes. Oh, my God. Yeah. 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 My book. I know who I am. Help me, Jesus. Lord have mercy. Oh, yeah. Yes, yes. Yeah. And, and when I think about it, my worst day become my best day. Yes, yes Lord. And, that's, um, yes, sir. and the devil don't want you thinking that way. Mm. He don't want you mm. thinking that way. But you got, you got, you got to let the Spirit talk to you. Oh, yeah. Because He reminds you of what Jesus says all the time. Yes, he he said, "My Father's house." He said, I go to prepare a place for you. Yeah. That where I am. And listen, listen to him pray. He said, Father, I pray that they be with me where I am, that they might behold my glory. Mm -hmm. One of these days, we're going to see his glory. Yeah. Oh, you, know, yeah. you know why? Because there ain't a prayer that he prayed that God didn't answer. Oh, yeah. He always prayed what was on the heart of the Father to give him. Yeah. Yeah. Help Oh, help oh, us, Lord. Yes. Oh, Lord. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. I'm already telling him, Lord. Help us, Lord. Yes, Lord. Oh, oh yes. Thank you, Lord. That'll work for tonight. We'll, we'll continue the book of Jude. Give you, some, give you a chance to go home and look at it and yes, study it and ask some questions and study. Yes, sir. It's only one chapter, but it's filled with all of the goodies. Yes. Thank God. So, Father, we thank you. We praise you. We thank you for your mercy and grace. We thank you for these people tonight. We pray. Father, for this church and this, this neighborhood, that they may be able, God, to be a light to some dying soul. Only way to hell, no weapon in their hand and no God on their side. We pray for all the young men, oh Lord, standing on our corners and nothing in their hands to do, not realizing that time is being passed and the devil has brought them out. Save them, Lord, even now. Save them in a dying hour. Oh God, we claim them from the garbage heap today, Lord. Bless this church that it may be a sounding board, that they might hear the gospel message that Jesus came and died for our sins, raised, was raised from the dead, that we might have eternal life. We thank you in his name that we pray. Amen. Amen. All right, honey, let's do our offering.